I have no time to waste on the ways of the Drakir. Then why the fuck are we even... Why did we even just do this fucking trial if you don't care about this shit? Like, what the fuck, Dark? Is this because he said that was your grandpa? Is this why you're... Are you having an existential crisis or something? Oh no, he's pissed! You pissed him off! You pissed him off! And now he's... Dark, wait! You have a fair amount of dragon within you. Your windstone has been broken in two. Just as you yourself are incomplete. That's some deep shit. Just like I'm split in two, literally. Look, half Deimos, half human. The windstone is incomplete. You didn't... He knew... He, did he really not know that that was split in half? Didn't Lilia tell him that someone else had the other half? That it, it, She thought it was his brother or whatever? I think she might have actually brought that up. I think she was the first one to realize it. I only have half of it. Yeah. We've, we've known this. Right? I'm not crazy. Darker, you're so stupid. The wind's protection and its destiny too are split in two. And I'm not gonna choose you at the end, so Karg's gonna win. Into dragon and man, into demos and human. Though the wind be divided, still it remains. And should two winds meet, though they collide, through they struggle, finally they form a single vortex. Exactly, that's why I'm like, I don't think that it matters what side you choose ultimately, because at the end of the game, they both come together and work together. So it doesn't really fucking matter what side I choose, but I've never picked Karg's side, so I'm going to, just to see if it's slightly different. That is the wind's destiny, it's fate. Well, it's gonna happen, you're right, because I've played the game and I know how it ends. I shall settle once more into my eternal slumber. Farewell, son of Windoff. Yeah, I don't think it's a coincidence that his name's Windoff. Willow, my grandpa. Until the day you return to me. Oh god. Thought his eye was gonna turn red and evil. Why did it turn red there for a second? That was weird. I guess because it's good and evil? I don't know. The wind's destiny. Are you telling me to find the other windstone? I think it's telling you to find the other person who owns the windstone and to merge together and have incestual relations and be butt buddies with your brother. I think that's what it's saying. I might be wrong. Goodbye. Nice meeting you. I still got the crown. I don't know why I wouldn't still become the director leader just because I can. I mean, at this point, I might as well. He makes a lot of stupid decisions for someone obsessed with power. Thanks for waiting. We're going back to Drakirnia. Were they just gonna ditch you? <laughs> well, Camilla might. What? Going back? You got the Dragon Master crown? Duh. Why else would I... I'm sure I would have been dead if I didn't. I... I got it. Everything's fine. I knew you could do it, Dark! You didn't sound like you knew I could do it, but thank you, sweetheart. I'll give you a good fuck later. I'll lift up that tail and just you know, ram into you. See? Just like I told you. No need to worry so much. Well, Volk, Volk she, loves, she loves him. Oh, shut your snout. I wasn't worried in the slightest. Okay, okay. Now Willow will tell us where Dragoose is hiding out. Yeah, Willow, my grandpa. You gonna tell him that? Yes, Willow. What is it, Dark? He's my. Never mind. Yeah, they don't really care, probably anyway. But he's your grandpa. Let's get back to Dracarnia. He owes you a lot of Christmas presents, so hopefully he'll give them to you when we get back. He better have them Christmas presents. Dot 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 dot. What's going on? What is it? I'm gonna say I want to do this alone, huh? I'm gonna see Willow well alone. I figured cuz like he didn't tell him that he's his grandpa. He doesn't want them to know for some reason, so he wants to do this conversation alone. Hmm. Why 
so serious all of a sudden. What's gotten into you, Dark? Come on, you're not the Joker. Shush. Dark soul. Amber sorrow. Red, brown. Bewilderment. Yeah, he's fucking bewildered as fuck because he's just found out about his grandpa and that his mom is a fucking human, which I think he already knew. I hope he already figured that out. This is my own affair. It has nothing to do with you. I'm going alone. Hey, don't be so cold. We're going with you. Damn, Della. She's like, no, we're not. You're, we're going with you, bitch. He's not. That's not going to happen. We're your friends, aren't we? Aw, cutie pies. She, lo she loves him. Friends. What are friends? Listen to me carefully. I brought you along because I need you to help me unify the Deimos. That's all. We're not friends. I don't fucking like you guys. Damn, that is cold. So this is none of your business. Wait here. Ouch. That hurts. Delma loves you. Do as you please until I get back. And Bebador is a sweetheart. You're cold. Evil. Dick. At least they can have a little break from you. They all need that, I'm sure. Hmm. He's taking a long time. <laughs> you don't give a shit, do you? Your voice. Hmm. He's taking an awfully long time. A willow. -o. Do you think Doc is alright? I thought that I told you not to talk about him. But. I wouldn't expect the Demos wanna be like him to complete the dragon ordeal. You are such a dick of a fucking grandpa. You're supposed to spoil me. Heck, heck, cough. What the fuck? He's dying. Why is he dying? Is this a case of once. I was gonna say once a new leader takes over, does the old one die? But no, that's that's not the case, cause. Cause that's not what happened with uh, my dad. Ooh, there's the mark on his on his lower back. I guess that's why he failed to show us that. Even though we already know he's our grandpa, so we don't really need to see that now. Willow, are you all right? You don't care at all. Don't worry about it. I have fits like this all the time. Man, my grandpa's gonna die now. Dark, you're a bad luck magnet. Everywhere you go, people die. Oh, dark. Did you pass the dragon ordeal? Yeah, duh. Oh, ho, that's our dog. You like me. What are you, my uncle that diddles me? Is that who you are? Now go tell Willow. Hurry. I'm trying. Get off the ground, you old fucker. Cough, cough. Have you brought the dragon master crown? Yeah, here it is, bitch. It's huge! Didn't look that big on the pedestal. That's the crown, all right. Now it's time for you to keep your promise. Why don't you tell me where Dragoza is? All right. He ought to be around Thun Thunar Point. The deals with humans have a base camp there. Well, we'll take care of them too. Two birds, one stone, right? Disgusting though it is, Dragoza and his underlings are in cahoots with the humans, you see. Really? Damn, they're in cahoots with the humans? I didn't see that coming. I thought Dragoza was working on his own. So this makes sense why we team up in the end, because we're both after the same enemy then. If 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 Dragoza and them are working with Dillsweld. So his face right there, man, he is so sexy though. Look at that jaw. Look at the look at them eyes. Mmm, mmm. He is delicious. Um, so you really were pissed at me about being half human and being a traitor because my dad fucked a human and they're working with humans, so you couldn't you couldn't rat them out though? Fuck off. Dragoza is working with the Dillswald army. He really is a dirty Deimos. He's filthy. I need to clean him up. <clears throat> What's wrong? Are you sick? Aww. I don't have much longer. Just like Drakirnia. No, 
Oh, my grandpa's gonna die. I just found you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I have something to ask you. What's that? What's the crest of will? Who's Draguza? I mean, are we gonna get to ask all these? I wanna ask about Windolf's past first. Windolf. He was a young leader who had the respect and trust of every Drakir alive. But he changed when he met a human woman named Nafia. Hell yeah, we know her name now. Shit, that's awesome. Lilia might have already told us Nafia about Nafia and Karg. But now it's like solid. It's solidified. He broke Demos' law and had you. I banished him from the tribe. It had to be done. What about the other kid? Tell him about the other kid. Such a crime should it couldn't be overlooked after all. At this point, he stole our windstone. The treasure of the Drekyar tribe. But he gave that to me to protect me. I had to send someone after him. I simply had no choice. Can you understand how I felt? This was my son! Oh, what a hope I had for him! So you just said you're my grandpa! My son who surrendered the throne of Drakir leadership. He turned his back on everything! Ooh, now Nafia is down here. I don't think that was there before. But let's just ask about this now. I, and now that I know I get to ask more than one thing. What's the crest of will? It's that thingy on your arm. Huh. You know about that. Proof of the blood that ties you and me. It's disgusting. That birthmark on your arm. That's the crest of Will. Windolf had it too. Well duh, he's my dad. It's it's in our bloodline. And on my back, so do I. I know, I just saw it. I, I realized that the camera did that on purpose. You wanted to show me that. So w when he meets Karg and he sees that crest, he will know they are 100% related even if Karg doesn't know it he will know unless he's he's really fucking stupid so hopefully he will put put that together I would hope so the crest of will is a holy seal in the shape of a birthmark that can be found throughout the generations of the will line from father to son it's a family mark that's sure to be found somewhere on the body and it's right on the same spot. Because technically they're twins. They don't look anything alike. Which is fine. I mean, not all twins look alike. But their birthmarks are in the exact same place. That is the crest of Will. So what about fucking Draguza? Who's this bastard? Well, we don't know who he really is. He's shrouded in mystery. He's so sexy. With his unicorn horn, he wanted to shove that up my asshole. I've asked him, but he says... Oh, it will get it dirty, but I have a clean asshole. I've been waiting for his unicorn horn up my ass. Oh, I dream about it. He showed up in Dracarnia some time ago. He had the Dracula all stirred up over getting their windstone back. He took strong young Dracula with him when he left. Dracarnia, having lost the windstone in the village youth, has become as you see it today. So, like... I'm sure that Drakir, like, I'm sure that Draguza is working with the humans with every intent to take all of the stones at the end and take over the fucking world. Just like I'm sure that the humans are working with Draguza for the same reason. I don't think that they're actually in cahoots. I think they're, right, like, gonna backstab each other. Because why would they work together? It doesn't make much sense except for to get the product that they want. There is no future for Drakirnia, I'm afraid. How do you know? Maybe we could change it. Tell me about my mama. She was a human girl who lived on this continent. I know. Nafia wanted the windstone and seduced Windolf. No, that's not what happened. Oh my fucking god. I mean, I don't like Nafia, really. I don't really. She's very preachy. She hides shit. She. She lies to her son. She's, she's, I don't know. I don't really like her as a character. She's up there with Lilia on my least liked characters. She's a good person, though. She, even though she's lying to her son and stuff, she's doing it with the right intentions or whatever. There is no way in fuck she seduced Windolf just to get that stone. Come on, you are just making up lies. Because cause you're his dad and you were like trying. That's what dads do whenever you get with somebody that they don't approve of. They're like, 
Oh yeah, she, she, she did it all. Or vice versa, he did this to you. She was the one who approached him. She started it. This is a fact. I doubt that, highly. But when the pursuers I sent after my son cornered that human gal, she, she fell off a cliff along with her baby. Damn, yo, this is getting tense. See, it's in yellow because that's important. Her baby, he's talking about little baby Karg, a little Kargster, oh my god. Dark's figuring all this shit out. Poor Karg, he's just so oblivious because his mom's a fucking lying hoe. And died. They did not die. Well, now I gotta ask about this baby. The human woman had given birth to twins. Yeah, that's what I thought because they were the same age. They had to be twins. And one is you. And the other one is your brother. Dark and Karg. He knows his name? Oh my god. Dark, you have to put this together now. You have to. Lilia said that there was someone with the other half of the stone in Nidelia or wherever. And that his name was Karg. And maybe he's your brother. She basically said all of that. So if you don't put this together now... There's no fucking hope for you. There's no fucking hope for you. You are one brother of a set of twins, but he's... They're all dead now. But... But Lilia said that she met Karg. So he's not dead, and you should know that. Nafia, your brother Karg. Windolf, everybody's gone. But they thought I was dead too. They must have, because of how the, this guy reacted. The only one left is you. Fine, never mind, that's enough. I've learned everything. Dark, I'm proud of you. For Windolf's son to have grown up so strong and healthy and to have returned to Drakirnia. Now I have no regrets. Well, that's good at least, Gramps. Did you hear all that? That's a lot to swallow. Just like swallowing my dick, Sagan. Just what we expected of you, Doc. The Drakir and all of Drakirnia have been saved. Willowo and I can finally relax and be ready to make that final journey to join the great dragon soul. I didn't really do anything. I didn't save anything for sure. He doesn't even want to take over. I do. Damn, that was a lot to swallow. So I. I had a brother. A twin. Yeah, you, you still do. I swear to God, Lilia said his name before. If he were alive. He would have gone through the same trials, through the same thoughts, felt the same pain I have. Karg, Karg didn't have to go through the same trials or feel the same things as you yet. Because his, his, his demo side's inside of him. It's not outside of him right now. Until later, and then he will have to deal with it, but... Yeah, that's really, I don't know. He is alive though. Lily already mentioned him. But he's dead. So you are an idiot. You are the epitome of idiocy. So in the end, I'm still just the same lone Deimos wannabe after all. Aw, he wanted somebody like him out there. Karg is out there, but you're going to be highly disappointed because he doesn't look like you. He looks completely human except for some things that happen. Wait. It's coming back to me. Thank you. Oh my god. About damn time. Jesus Christ. Didn't Lilia say something about having met a human named Karg? I am so glad you figured this out. Because if you hadn't, I swear to God. I would have I would have gone through my computer screen, grabbed your head, and uh, popped it. Just popped it like a fucking zit or something. Because you are a fucking idiot. And you don't need a head. The rest of you is... I mean, I'll just still use the rest of you. But you don't need a fucking head if you can't figure that shit out. And his mother's name was Nafia. Yes! 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 Yes. Finally. Is this just a coincidence? Shut up! No! What the fuck? Dark. Don't say that. He is named Karg. He had the other half of the spirit stone. She mentioned, she might have mentioned something about his birthmark as well. But she definitely said she, he had the other half of the spirit stone. His name is Karg, and his mom's name is Nafia. You think that's a fucking coincidence? Dark, you think that's a coincidence? Then 
there's no hope for Deimos kind. Because you're like the smartest Deimos. Or is it... Sheesh, what am I thinking? How could I be reeled in by a story like that? It's just fucking crazy. That was just something silly. Lillian made up. But it matches. Of course, that's all it is. No, it's not. Now you're just fucking in denial. At least you're not an idiot. He is a human, though. So you probably won't be very excited to meet him, because... You'll be like, well, you're you're just proof that I'm a fucking wannabe and not Deimos at all. Hello again. <laughs> After all that shit, like, oh, I don't love you, you're not my friends, he just walks up. Hello again. <laughs> well, did you find out about Draguza? He's at the Dillswell base at Thunor Point, it seems. Why? Why would Draguza be at a Dillswell base? Willowo says he's working with the humans. I don't like the sound of that. Nobody should. Draguza? Human? They're all the same to me. Let's smash them all and get that water stolen. Hell yeah, Dumb, let's go. <laughs> Dumb just goes right into me. Somehow that Orcon girl's enthusiasm seems to be catching. Yeah, I know. It's, it is. It is. Let's go. Bevador just runs in. What do you got to say, Volk? By the way... Are you done with your own matter of revenge? By the way, like, now that I think about it, at the end, Volk's gonna be trying to avenge his family, and Paulette's gonna be trying to avenge her dad, because they killed, like, they killed each other's respective families. So, in a sense, the end battle of who you pick also decides if you pick Paulette or Volk. That's depressing. And I guess if you pick Gons, or if you pick the guy that killed Gonza's boyfriend. Oh, that. Yes, more or less. Dark. What? You may not like to hear this, but I feel the same as Delma. Aww, you cuties. I consider myself to have your same goals, to be your ally, and maybe even your friend. Aww, cute. I ship it. I ship it, but I ship him with Delma the most. But, I mean, they can have a threesome. You know, Delma is the Orcon whore. She could just take all take all the dicks. And Camilla can just watch, and Bebador can not watch, because she looks like a fucking child. Man, that's so cute! Yeah, Dark. They're your friends. Stop being a dick to them. <laughs> Allies. Friends. No less. That damn Volk. He's sounding more like a human every day. Is that a bad thing, though? I don't think it's a bad thing. I think it's a good thing. If Deimos could just be a little bit more human, and humans could just be open-minded to Deimos, everything would get better.